So what other questions do you have about local service ads, Jacob? You know, sometimes you can't just answer all the calls that happen. So whenever there's a missed call, it's important to call them back right away, right? It's important to call them back right away. But more importantly, it's important to answer the call and have that call be over 30 seconds um, and then and then pay for the call. If it's one of the job types that you're accepting. Right. Um, and, yeah. and did you review our records in the past few, like a month? Are our, our, our calls answered a lot or we have a lot of missed calls? No, you don't have many missed calls. I mean, you, you guys have definitely gotten a lot better about that. You know, obviously, this is one of the big things that Google is going to pay attention to. And I'm glad that you got a call center, Jacob. Yes. Because we work with realtors as well. And, you know, they don't want to take all the calls because they get a lot of rental calls. They want seller and buyer leads, you know, and just like you want certain type of immigration attorney leads. But you've got to weave through the leads in order to get the ones that are really the, the best cases for you. And you want to make sure that we're, that we're identifying what your return on investment is by identifying you know, how many of those cases were converted. That's what we really want to know is how many cases are you getting out of those 350 leads that you've gotten over the past you know, year? We're really grateful that we have access to your data because you know, we're building software right now to identify when you got increases in your call volume, what did that correlate to? We now are able to pull in data that you can't get anywhere else. Be careful, at least preliminarily, I would say, um, to make sure that you're only disputing calls that really need to be disputed of the calls that are over 30 seconds. Okay. So anybody has any questions, you know, you can reach out to us. You can um, put a comment below. We just want to get feedback. I mean, hopefully this yeah. is value. This is valuable information mm -hmm. to you. I think it's going to be good for a lot of people, especially attorneys to um, get on this because it's like, it's like an extra lead source. Why not? Yeah. I mean, we're finding that that PI attorneys are getting cases for three hundred and fifty dollars, and they normally spend yeah. three thousand five hundred dollars. We're talking like one tenth the, the normal cost per yeah, conversion. Yeah. If I if I were you as a business owner, I would think like Jacob and think about how you can yeah. now, if you're currently running local service ads, how you can how you can take it to the next level. You definitely need somebody that understands. Like we've got, so I didn't. I don't know if I told you, Jacob, but. But Crystal is now a silver product expert with Google My Business. So, so okay. she's now, there's only about 40 of them in the world. Yeah. We can help you set up that location because we've got people on our team that, that do this. Every, they help people every day in the forum. And they, so they've seen every different scenario. How much do we spend per month? And, and how do we control, who controls the spend? So you're spending about uh, $2,000 a month. On this, right? Yeah, you're spending about two grand a month, which <clears throat> I think is, I mean, based on your cost per conversion. Who set it up though to spend two thousand? Um, we we set it up. I mean, we can we can increase or decrease your budget whenever you want. Okay. Like I said before, I mean, you're getting you're getting cases for half or even twenty five percent of what you're paying for regular Google ads. Do we know how much the other attorneys are paying? We don't. We can't tell that. No, you can't tell that, but. Like, you know, I mean, these guys right here, there's, there's, they're paying about $120 for a conversion. You know, I mean, that's about the average cost for a, for a new case in your industry. Right. Up here, you know, your, your cost per case is around 50 bucks, you know, yeah. 40, 40 to 40 to $60. Yeah. You know? <clears throat> so it's worth it to keep it at that for now. I would, I know I would, if you, if you're running, if you're running ads, I would take all the money that you got. And I told you this probably eight months ago. I would take all the money that you're spending in Google ads and I would max out whatever you're doing with local service ads because you're, you're just you're going to save money. So you're saying that I should stop doing the, the Google ads, uh, keep, just keep the call only ads. Google ads, I would use these as only a filler for, for after you've maxed out what you're running on local service ads. Because you're, you're acquiring leads at 50% or 25% of what you're spending down here in regular Google ads. Yeah. So it just makes sense to max out your budget. If you're spending all your budget every week, which is about 500, 600 bucks a week, I would, I would turn it up to a thousand, two thousand dollars, you know, um, and, and spend the money here, max it out, get as many leads as you can from local service ads. And, and only fill in with the number of leads that you need additionally with Google Ads.
paying twice as much for a Google ad. So why would you keep doing that when you can pay half that for, you know, for local service ads right now?